Hello, you're welcome. How to solve this nice exponential equation? Solution from here. Let's take 3 raised to the power 6 to the left hand side. Then this becomes k plus 4 raised to the power 6. Then minus 3 raised to the power 6 equals to 0 from here. Then here we can rewrite this as k plus 4 raised to power 3 then raised to power 2 as 2 times 3 here will still be 6 then minus 3 raised to power 3 here then raised to power 2 as well equals to 0 from here then from a square minus b square which is same thing as a plus b into bracket then also into bracket a minus b close bracket then here we can treat k plus 4 is to power 3 as a so we have a equals to k plus 4 is to power 3 then b equals to 3 raised to power 3 then the equation here now becomes k plus 4 raised to power 3 plus 3 raised to power 3 into bracket also open bracket k plus 4 raised to power 3 minus 3 raised to power 3 close bracket then equals to 0 from here then here we have two possible cases the first one we have either k plus 4 raised to power 3 plus 3 raised to power 3 equals to 0 or we have k plus 4 raised to power 3 minus 3 raised to power 3 equals to 0 from here then when we solve from the first case here this follows from a raised to power 3 minus b raised to power 3 which is same thing as plus b raised to power 3 rather which is same thing as a plus b into bracket then open bracket a square minus a b plus b square then here this equation now becomes k plus 4 plus 3 then into bracket k plus 4 square then minus 3 times k plus 4 then plus 3 square plus bracket equals to 0 from here then what we have here is same thing as k plus 7 then into brackets here the expansion here give us k square plus 8k plus 16 the minus 3 open here we have minus 3k minus 12 then plus 3 square here 3 times 3 that's 9 close brackets equals to 0 from there and also we can bring this together and this we have k plus 7 into bracket then open bracket k square then plus 8k minus 3k give us plus 5k then here we have 16 minus 12 give us 4 then plus 9 we have 13 that's plus 13 then equals to 0 from there which also implies from here we have two possible cases we have either k plus 7 equals to 0 or we have k square plus 5k plus 13 equals to 0 from here and on this side we have k equals to minus 7 so which is a real solution and here we have a quadratic solution where a equals to 1 
b equals to 5 and c equals to 13. And using the formula, k equals to minus b plus or minus square root of b square minus 4ac over 2a. Then we have k equals to minus 5 plus or minus square root of 5 square minus 4 times 1 times 13. 10 over 2 times 1 which implies here we have k equals to minus 5 plus or minus square root of 5 square that's 25 then minus here we have 52 then over 2 that is here this gives us k equals to minus 5 plus or minus square root of minus 27 over 2 from here which also we can write as k equals to minus 5 plus or minus root 9 times 3 times minus 1 over 2 and when we separate this root 9 that's 3 so we have k equals to minus 5 plus or minus 3 then root 3 root minus 1 is i then over 2 so here we have two complex solutions from here then from the second case here it follows from a raised to power 3 minus b raised to power 3 which is a minus b into bracket then open bracket a square plus a b then plus b squared then what we have now becomes k plus 4 minus 3 into brackets then open bracket we have k plus 4 squared then plus 3 times k plus 4 then plus 3 squared close brackets equals to zero from here and what we have here same thing as k plus one then two brackets then also here expansion here becomes k square plus 8k plus 16 then three open this bracket we have plus 3k plus 12 then plus 9 here close bracket equals to 0 from here that is here we can bring this together further and we have k plus 1 then into bracket k square 8k plus 3k equals 11k then we have 16 plus 12 that's 28 then plus 9, we have 37, then close bracket equals to 0 from there. Which also implies here we have two cases, k plus 1 equals to 0 or we have k squared plus 11k plus 37 equals to 0 from here. On this side, we have k equals to minus 1 then from here we have a quadratic equation where a equals to 1 b equals to 11 and c equals to 37 that is from here k equals to minus 11 plus or minus square root of 11 square minus 4 times 1 times 37 then over 2 times 1 then from here this becomes k equals to minus 11 plus or minus square root of 11 square that's 121 then minus 148 here over 2 from here 
that is this becomes k equals to minus 11 plus or minus square root of minus 27 over 2 and from here root minus 27 is same thing as 3 root 3 high then here we have k equals to minus 11 plus or minus 3 root 3 high over 2 so also here we have two complex solutions then all together we have six solutions here two resolutions and four complex solutions so thank you for watching don't forget these steps subscribe for more videos and turn the notification bell on share this video give it a thumbs up and see you next class bye for now